Hello everyone. Today I wanted to do a short and fun video about um, different words, acronyms, or phrases you may have seen or heard around um, social media, online articles, and different places around the crypto community. Um, and so I hope this will be helpful in case there's some of these that you haven't um, heard before. And so let's just dive right in. Um, ATH stands for all-time high. This is when a, the price of a particular coin. Um, so bear and bull. Bear is when a general direction of a, of a price for a coin, for example, is going downwards. And bull is when it's trending upwards. And a trap is when it's been going one direction for a while. And then it looks like it's about to go up the other direction, but then it comes back down. Um, BIP and EIP, this is Bitcoin Improvement Proposal and Ethereum Improvement Proposal. And these are basically um, improvement or changes to the, the protocol that developers or other people in the community propose. And then people can decide whether to accept it or not. Um, a bubble is when something has grown in price way too rapidly and it's unsustainable. And that stretches the bubble and it might pop and then the price will drop back down rapidly. A bot is usually like when traders write automated algorithms or code that do their strategy for them um, just really quickly so they don't have to do it manually themselves. Adapt is short for a decentralized app and this is basically an app that you build using smart contracts on any smart contract platform like Ethereum, um, Rootstock on Bitcoin, etc. EEA is the Ethereum or the Enterprise Ethereum Alliance and basically a group of companies that are interested in exploring what they can do um, on the Ethereum platform. A faucet is a website usually where you can sign up and get free coins but just a little bit because um, they just want to give you some to play around with and they might get like ad revenue from visits and whatnot. Fiat is currency such as the US dollar or the Japanese yen, um, just dollars that, or just money backed by governments pretty much. Flippening is used in the, in the Ethereum, basically saying the potential day where Ethereum's market cap exceeds Bitcoin's. A fork is when a crypto coin, like Bitcoin's for example, um, splits into two. And so while it shared the same blockchain for history, um, at a certain point in time, the blockchain split into two, and it basically works at two, as two separate coins now. Um, FOMO buy, FOMO stands for fear of missing out, and panic sell. Or um, FOMO buy means that like if the price is going up rapidly, you buy it because you don't want to miss out on the growth. Panic sell is, is if the price drops rapidly, you sell your coins because you're worried that it'll go down. Usually, both of these are not good to do. Um, in the long run. FUD stands for fear, uncertainty, or doubts. And this is especially if someone comes in, tries to scare people to sell their coins, um, mostly if they want cheaper coins for them to buy themselves later. HODL or hold um, is pretty much the same thing. It started out someone um, misspelling it in the Bitcoin forums and became a really popular meme afterwards. It could also stand for a hold on for dear life. Usually people say this when the price is dropping and people get worried. They're like, it's okay, just hodl or just hold and we'll be okay. ICO is an initial coin offering. It's when um, new companies or dApps um, want to put out their own crypto coins for the public to buy. Usually you can send Bitcoin or Ethereum and get those coins in return. Lambo is a fun one when people say that they can't wait to everyone buy Lambos with all the money we make from our cryptocurrencies. Moon is also similar. It's saying that the price of a certain coin is going to the moon, so it's going really, really high. POW stands for proof of work. POS stands for proof of stake. These are two different ways for consensus algorithms um, for different blockchains to decide which transactions or which blocks will get put on the chain next. Pump and dump is an activity when a group of people buy a, lot of, buy a lot of a certain coin really quickly, get the price really high, and hope that other people try to buy as well to ride the wave up. And then the first group sells it all at the top, and then the people who bought late are, are left with nothing. 
Uh, Satoshi is the um, anonymous founder of Bitcoin, but also the smallest denomination for Bitcoin. A shill is a person who um, goes around saying different things um, about certain coins, for example, most likely to trick people for their own benefit. TA is technical analysis. Um, it's for when people look at historical graph of a certain coin's price and try to look for patterns that can, uh, patterns for them to estimate future price. FA is fundamental analysis, and that's when people look at like the team or the technology behind a certain coin and try to gauge how a coin will will do in the future because of that. A token is the same word for a coin, usually. A way is the smallest denomination for an ether, for Ethereum. A whale is like a big um, back holder of coins or very rich and very powerful trader. Um, who can buy a lot of coins at a given time or sell a lot of coins at a given time and move the market rapidly. 2FA or two-factor authentication, um, sometimes also TFA, is when people use a additional security check for signing in to different exchanges or when doing actions like selling their coins or sending their coins um, by having an app on their phone where they get uh, randomized digits that they have to input in order to do those actions. Okay, so thank you everyone, that was it. Um, if there's anything that you think I've missed or you have questions about, please leave me a comment below. Also, please subscribe because I will be putting out more videos very soon. Thank you.